What's up guys, Jake Berlin with Apocalypse Movies and I'm here to review Hell or High Water. Um, if you've been able to check out the trailers, very, very small movie. Um, stars Chris Pine, Ben Foster, and Jeff Bridges. Um, it's kind of a western in modern day, uh, centered in Texas. And it's about two brothers who uh, become bank robbers to save their farm. And Jeff Bridges plays uh, the Texas Ranger who's after him. Um, very, very small, contained story, indie film. Um, I think it's in wide release right now. I definitely recommend it. I mean, right off the bat, I I really, really enjoy this. Like, wholeheartedly enjoyed this movie. Um, so much so that I think I'm going to have to rearrange my top 10 2016, and it might stay there for a while. Um, you know, again, this is going to be non-spoilers. I'm not going to ruin it for anybody who wants to check it out. But I 100% recommend this movie. I think that... Uh, one, the performances were unbelievable by all three of the mains. Uh, I think that Chris Pine, you know, he's kind of been, you know, ID'd as, the, as this pretty boy, you know, not not the greatest actor, takes different roles. We know him from Star Trek, but he's only been good in Star Trek or whatever. I really enjoy him personally. And I think this is a breakout mm -hmm. performance for him. Um, he plays such a different character, and I think that he crushes the role. Um, and, you know, he, he plays alongside ben, ben Foster, and they bounce off each other, and it could not have been more perfect. Ben Foster, you know, he's been around for a while. He's had really, really good roles, and but he hasn't really had that one role that's elevated him to superstar status. This might be it. And I think that, um, you know, Chris Pine plays this hardened, uh, serious, uh, really father figure, trying to do right for his family, um, more of the reserve brother, where Ben Foster is just totally outgoing, like, I'm, you know, I have one life and I'm going to live it. I'm going out there and do whatever the hell I want. Has total fun with it. And he's a great, great time. I think that, uh, you know, Ben Foster, uh, we've seen him in Mechanic Resurrection. We've seen him, you know, he was in Warcraft. Uh, he was in the program as Lance Armstrong. Mm -hmm. um, this might be my all-time favorite role of his. And same, as for going with Chris Pine as well, even though I loved him as Captain Kirk, I still do. I think he's fantastic in that role. This might be my favorite his as well. Uh, you know, Ben Foster is definitely the comedic side of the movie, um, where Chris Pine's kind of the drama side, and they they go off each other really well. And you know, speaking I and mean, going for Jeff Bridges as well, he's Jeff Bridges. What else is he gonna say? He does this, the same thing, and he just he's great, and he's always fun to see on screen, especially in a western like this. Um, you, you can tell that he's having fun with it. Same with Chris Pine and Ben Foster. Uh, you know, as, as for the story, phenomenal. I think that it was written to fantastic. Uh, I think that this movie is going to be on the award season watch list for sure when it comes early next year. Um, as far as poor performances go, screenplay, writing, all of it, it's just going to be up there. Um, I think that it was a very contained, smaller story, but it worked mm -hmm. out so well. You travel to different spots in Texas. Um, I think the bank, it, the bank robbing scenes were planned out perfectly. I thought the idea behind the movie is really, really strong. Um, I can't recommend it enough. I mean, I, it's hard for me to not find anything wrong with the movie. I think that there may have been some slow, slow parts in the middle or towards the end, um, kind of took you out of the scenes that were really, you know, high octane, intense, thrilling, that kind of stuff. But I think that towards the end of the movie, it all pays off. And it all culminates into one spot, which is kind of what the movie was leading towards. And it, it, it definitely satisfies. I think that if you're questioning going to check it out, if you're going to question Westerns or whatever it is, I think that um, you, you, you're going to go in pretty happy with what you watch. And I think you should go in with an open mind. It's a really good time. Um, again, you go in, you're going to be very satisfied with Ben Foster, Chris Pine, and Jeff Bridges. I think that uh, they elevate the movie to what it is. The writing and directing behind the movie is phenomenal. Um, one of the best movies of the year for sure. So uh, real quick before I get out of here, I'm going to give you guys a score out of 10. Like I said, I can't really find anything wrong with the movie. I think that um, this this movie de deserves a 9.5 out of 10 from me. And I went in with some high expectations because of what I heard. And um, it, it satisfied on all levels. And I think that... Um, it deserves every kind of buzz it's going to get and any kind of viewing it's going to get. I highly recommend it. Like, seriously, I highly recommend it. Go check it out if it's anywhere near you. 
Um, but again, 9.5 out of 10 for me. Uh, my name is Jake Berlin. You can find me on Twitter and Instagram at QuiGonJake. PogMixMovies.com every day. This YouTube channel as well. Uh, Geo Jacob and I are trying to do big things here. Give us a like, share, and, and subscribe. We would really, really appreciate it. Check out the site. Mm -hmm. Putting up good art articles every day as well. Um, and until next time, see you later.